You're listening to the Experiencing God Day by Day podcast, brought to you by Blackaby Ministries International. September 14th, Life and Light, John 1, verse 4. Life was in him, and that life was the light of men. When Jesus came to a world that was in bondage to darkness and dead in its sin, he came as light and life. His light dispelled sin's darkness wherever he went, for the forces of evil could not withstand him. The life he brought was abundant and free, available to all who were dead in their sin. Ephesians 2 verse 1, John 10 verse 10. If you are a Christian, Jesus lives in you, and his light is within you. Christians are called to dispel darkness. Ephesians 5 verse 11. The light of Christ ought to shine so brightly through you that those practicing darkness are uncomfortable when they are around you. The light within you should dispel darkness from the lives of your friends, co-workers, and family members. The fullness of life found in Christ dwells within you as a Christian. Colossians 1 verse 27. The life that Jesus offers is available to others through you. Don't discount what you have to give to those who are hurting. Christ's life within you is more than sufficient to meet every human need. When people encounter you, they encounter Christ within you. You do not know all the answers, but you have someone within you who does. You will not carry the burden of the needs of others. Christ will. Be aware that just as many resisted Jesus, so there will be those who resist the truth that you offer. John 1 verse 11. Be thankful, however that God chooses to express himself through you, giving light and life to those around you. This podcast is based on the book Experiencing God Day by Day by Henry and Richard Blackaby, published by B&H Publishing Group, music by Mark Brown. 